I am Akira. I'm a salary man. I'm 27 years old, working hard and living a reasonable life. Lately, I have a problem. You're already 27, aren't you? Get a girlfriend and get married soon. My parents are nagging me to get married at every opportunity. I'm satisfied with my life as a solo, so I don't feel like getting married. It seems like a hassle to adjust to the other person. I always say I'm not interested in marriage. Don't say that. Why don't you try getting married at least once? Marriage is a good thing. To do that, you have to find a partner first though. Let's say that marriage is a good thing. But looking for a partner because you want to get married is the opposite order, isn't it? It is right to want to get married because you have found someone you love. I wouldn't do something like that, where the means and the end are reversed. Hmm, in other words, if you like someone, you can marry her? Then I'll bring the person of your choice to an arranged marriage. There is no such girl. I've never had a girlfriend in my life. But that's because the girl of my choice never showed up. It is not because I was not popular. It's not okay. You won't know if you don't look for one. Tell me what you like in a woman. Oh, shut up! If I give them absurd conditions, will they back down? Alright, then I'll tell you my conditions. First of all, she must be beautiful. She should be good enough to win a beauty contest in school. Also, she must be good at both study and sports. She must be a graduate of a top university and have participated in a national tournament in her club activities. Also, I am not a good cook, so it would be great if she is a good cook. If she is like this, I am willing to meet her. Your ideals are too high. Just because you were good at both study and sports, you shouldn't be like that. I don't think there is a woman like that. I don't want to impose my ideals on real women. That's why I'm not getting married. Well, okay. I'll go look for one. A few days later, my mother called me. She said she found my ideal partner. I thought she's lying, but if she insisted that she had found her, there was nothing I could do. I decided to meet her. And then... I found someone I knew. What? Why is she here? Well, I never thought that they were from the same high school. That's a surprise, isn't it? Haha. <laughs> she... Shizuka is not on that level of being from the same high school. She was my enemy in every way. The same top grades. We belonged to the same tennis club. And we were both good players. In the student council, I was president and Shizuka was vice president. We were always rivals. We went to different universities, so we haven't seen each other since we graduated from high school. Long time no see, Akira-san. Yeah, long time no see, Shizuka-san. Oh, Akira-san, you've never called me like that. On the other hand, Shizuka. What's with you, Shizuka-san? You called me Shizuka in high school, even though I wasn't your girlfriend. Well, the rest is up to you too, young people. Wait, don't leave me alone, please! Hey, why are you here? That's my phrase. It's my mom's fault. I'm a marriageable age and I don't even have a boyfriend. So she's been nagging me to meet this guy. She told me that the guy was highly educated and very talented. So I went to see him at least once. I didn't expect you to show up. It really sucks. It's the same for me. I had high expectations because I was told that someone who was beautiful enough to win the top prize at the beauty pageant and is a good cook would be coming. Too bad. She won the Miss Contest and she's good at cooking. Shizuka looks agitated. Oh well. From the beginning, I wasn't expecting that much. I mean, I'm surprised. I thought you were already married. You are beautiful so it's not difficult to find a guy, right? Well, there are guys who come on to me. And I've been invited to blind dates. So I've been meeting people. But 
Not enough to get married. But everyone around me is asking me to get married. So I thought I'd come here and see if I could find a good guy on an arranged marriage. So, I'm the one who came out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. I'm the one who came out. In any case, it's not going to work. I'm going to get a lot of comments from my mom about getting a boyfriend. Since we have already met today, she'll give up on you, right? It's the opposite! Since we've met once, she is sure that I meet the second guy, and she'll be looking for someone new. You should be prepared for that too. Seriously? I mean, do you have any interest in marriage, Akira? Yeah, yes. I like the solo life. It's nice and easy. That's why I don't like it when people ask me to get married. Wow. It's rare that I get along with you. I'm the same way. I'm too good alone. But I see. Then we have the same interests. Hey, Akira. How about we get married? What? Of course. Just to tell people we're married, but it doesn't mean we'll really be married. In a way, it should be like sharing a room. In short, it's a fake marriage. I see. If we can split the rent and utilities 50-50, we can save money. That's not bad. But, you don't like me, right? I don't like you either, to be honest. Do you think it will work? It's okay that we don't like each other. As for me, I don't have to worry about you trying to get something from me. So on the contrary, I'm relieved. I see. If either one of us likes someone else, we will end the relationship once and for all. Considering such a case, it is safe to go with a de facto marriage without registering a marriage certificate. Okay. We have a contract. Thus began our fake marriage. We rented a two-bedroom apartment. Two rooms are private rooms for each of us, and the living room is a shared space. Let's decide how to divide up the housework. I'm good at cooking, so I'll be in charge. Then I'll do the dishes. Cooking takes time, so I'll do more of the cleaning. In return, please make me something good, okay? Who are you talking to? Other details were decided as we lived together. Strange. This woman was supposed to be my enemy, but I'm more comfortable than when I was living alone. To get pissed off every time I saw this guy. But now, I feel so much more relaxed when I'm with him. I'm not stressed at all. I thought we would clash because we were living together as enemies. But that didn't happen. Rather, perhaps because we read each other's thoughts and engaged in a friendly competition during our high school days, we are in perfect harmony. No way. This woman is... Is he an ideal marriage partner? No, it's impossible! No, no! Absolutely not! The only problem that seemed to happen was when our mothers came to our house. How is life as newlyweds? Are things going well? Of course! Right, Chizuka? Yeah, yeah, no problem. Hmm, but aren't you two a little far from each other? This is because we are in front of you, so... Oh no! You don't have to be so shy at all! Oh no! Mom is quite perceptive! If she gets suspicious, she might find out that it's a fake marriage! I don't have a choice! Well then, be my guest! Hmm? Hmm? Damn! Why is my face getting so hot just by crossing my arms? Hey! Why are you so nervous with this guy? I'm supposed to hate this guy so much! Wow, you guys are so in love! Marriage is so nice after all! And we got along well, with some small troubles. Then a big incident occurs that changes the relationship. Akira? The person next to him is... What am I upset about? Yes, I didn't think he could have a girlfriend, so I was just surprised, yes. That place is famous for engagement rings, I see. He really has found someone he likes. 
Shizuka, I need to talk to you. Please come to the living room. Okay. Sorry for taking up your time, so I need to talk to you. I know, I know. You want to terminate the contract, don't you? What? Just in time. I was just thinking that I wanted to get rid of it too. Ah, I am so relieved. I see. I see. But Shizuka, you say you're relieved. But if that's the case, why are you... Are you crying? What? This is a happy cry, because I hate you. You're always competing with me, and we've become so competitive. And because of that, I can't stop thinking about you. And lately, because we're living together, all I can think about is you. I hate you. You occupy my head. I hate you so much. I hate you so much. Shizuka. Shizuka, will you listen to me for a moment? This... I want you to marry me. I want you to marry me and become a real husband and wife. What? Wait a minute. Then... That girl you were walking with, didn't you give her the ring? What? You saw us? That woman is my sister. What? You don't look alike at all. Shut up. Unlike me, my sister is cool. I see. You thought my sister was my girlfriend, so you thought I would get out of the contract. I'm sorry for making you worry. I'm not worried about you, but I thought you didn't like me. I thought I didn't like you, but I was wrong. Now that I think about, my ideal type was you. I didn't even realize it myself, but I've always liked you. After we started living together, I realized how I felt. So Shizuka, marry me. I'm only going to say this once. I want to marry you too. I love you so much that I cry because I don't want the contract to be terminated. Thank you. Thus, we became a real married couple. My enemy in high school is now my best partner.